In this video, we will be taking a look at 8020's Idea Builder user interface. A notable feature is the ability to generate a bill of materials and export as an XML. We can find these tools under the File tab. Next, under the View tab, Settings. General settings allow us to modify units of measure and adjust the drawing size. Drawing settings allow us to adjust to default settings for bars, panels, and accessories. Control settings allow us to adjust the mouse direction and movement within the workspace. Up under Entities, we will see all products that will appear on the bottom. As you build within the workspace, products will populate into this list. Across the top, we have Delete, New, and Save tools. Then we have camera controls like Pan, Rotate, and Zoom. Then we have options for the default fastener. That fastener will join together any selected bars or newly created bars. Next, we have options for default hardware options that will be used to fasten panels or other accessories. That concludes the tour of the Idea Builder user interface. For more information, please visit 8020.net.